So in this vlog, we're gonna tell you all about our lives. We're moving, what? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Is this gonna be a half hour video? <laughs> Are we gonna ramble? I know the peeps love it when we ramble. Hashtag <laughs> rambling with the shepherds. <laughs> Thumbs up if you think we should do a weekly show <laughs> where we talk for an hour straight about whatever the heck comes to our brains at the time. Would watch, 10 out of 10. So we, we have a lot going on in our lives and uh, what greater way to keep people informed than by an impersonal video. I thought you were just gonna say, what better way to keep people informed than by telling them? Uh, I don't work at a church anymore. We still live in Wisconsin. But we still, we're still living in Rhinelander. That's the short of it. We still live in Wisconsin, even though we told some people we were moving to Minnesota and then we changed we our lied. minds because we did that. We lied. For as long as I can remember, I've always been doing creative things and I've always been interested in making a living as a creative. And so we decided that this next season was a great time to give that a try. And we thought maybe rather than packing everything up and moving, since most of my work will be online, um, that it was worth staying where we're at. We love this beautiful, place staying where we're at for the time being and getting things going and then see where things go after that so that's the current plan is to stay living here anyone who is in minnesota you may be sad that we're not moving back but you can still visit us here that's true hashtag fun fact about the shep fams another update is that the other night at 3 a.m our neighbors <laughs> Had a really loud party, no joke. Well, they they were blaring, and I am not exaggerating, blaring music at the top of their, I was gonna say lungs. <laughs> boom box. At the top of their boom box at 3 a.m. Again, not exaggerating. And the we funny thing is- We were woken up by a, a, a subwoofer. They weren't blaring music at 10 or 11 or midnight or one or even two. It started at three. So that's our other life update. Thanks for watching the vlog. <laughs> so what are some of the other, oh, I've, I left my book upstairs. I was, was gonna just bring... gonna say, we just hit a full year of doing the vlog. Oh yeah. And so. We started it last yeah. August. Oh yeah, last year at this so 50, time. 50, this is I think episode 54 or something like that. And so <sighs> we're, we've just been talking as a family about what we wanna do with the vlog and how much commitment we wanna have to it. And I talked a little bit about that in last week's vlog of just why? <laughs> Which, to be honest, I never watched. <laughs> I kind of forgot to watch it. it. So in it, I just explained <laughs> why I started the vlog and kind of where we're at with it. So if you want to watch that, you can look up here. I don't, I don't know how these links work, but you can. It's going to be wherever you see words that say click on this thing and watch it. <laughs> I'd ask the vlog viewers to tell us if you watch it and if you like it and if it's worth continuing in some capacity. So we got a decent amount of feedback for a number of you that said that you liked it. So it's worth continuing in some it's capacity. It's nice to know that people watch it. So the current plan with the vlog is we're not going to do weekly vlogs anymore, but I'll post when we have something to post. We'll post random stuff from our Europe trip um, over the next few weeks whenever I get around to actually posting it and then I'm hoping to actually put uh, a ton of the footage together into more of like a feature length documentary kind of like the Haiti Chronicles which if you want to watch that you can click on the thing that says watch cool Haiti stuff so be looking for that I don't know when that'll be coming out but this channel going forward we're not going to post as regularly but we'll still do random little videos as much as we can and keep so in summary well. we'll still be doing the vlog it just won't be every week so I've got to do something with that. So Andrea, what are you doing to make anyway. us the monies? I'm just doing more music stuff and teaching some extra music classes and trying to get more piano students. And, and as I already mentioned, I'm going to be doing media production. And so I'm putting together my portfolio and hopefully getting some clients doing video and music and audiobooks and just whatever I can figure <laughs> out. Um, <laughs> And so if you're interested in seeing some of the stuff that I'm up to, professional portfolio stuff, um, you can go to my website, which I will put on screen somewhere as well. <laughs> Apparently this is the thing. Um, if you want to know more, look here. Look somewhere. I don't know how the links work on YouTube, so it'll probably just be whoop right there. <laughs> 
that's uh, that's my website, and so you can see some of the projects that I've already done and any future projects that I'm going to be doing. So some of the projects that I'm really excited about that I'm hoping some of you will be excited about, and so let me know, like seriously comment, and let me know if you're interested in some of this stuff because I will be looking for people to help me with some of these projects. Basically what I'm doing is I'm writing three books and I'm making three documentaries. <laughs> so I'm working on a documentary for a ministry in Haiti. You've already probably seen some of the footage from us visiting there, teaching English there but I'm hoping to actually produce a full-length feature documentary. And then the other documentary about our trip to Europe, it's gonna be less professional, I suppose, but something. Um, and then there's a third one with a different ministry that I'm hoping to produce sometime next summer. So we've got three documentaries and then three books. Um, one of them is an untitled novel. Well, technically it has a title, I'm just not releasing it yet. But I will be hoping to have, find some people who are interested in reading it and giving some feedback before I publish it. I'm still working on that beauty philosophy project um, that I've been working on for almost 10 years and still haven't done what I'm supposed to with it. So I'm hoping to, to really push that forward this fall as well. Then there, I, I have a third book that uh, I'm, I'm excited about and it's a very unique how-to book. <laughs> Some of you will appreciate it. Most of you will, will just be like, well, Why? whatever. And at the, I mean, there will be some people who will be like, of course, Nate would write a book about that. So you'll just have to wait and see. I'll just bait you with that. And so that's, that's our update. Did I get everything? The sun's been setting this whole time in this short vlog life update. <laughs> <laughs> Once again, thank you to everybody who's been watching this vlog. And also thank you to everyone else who's been watching our lives <laughs> the people who followed and cared about us and we had a really really awesome summer we're really excited to share a ton more about that so yeah we're really excited about what what has happened and what is going to happen and that's all right our vlog. that's our vlog <laughs> wait is that our catch line that's our vlog and i'm sticking to it that's weird that's it's like that's my story and i'm sticking to it that's our vlog and we're sticking to it do you like it no <laughs> <laughs> what Catchphrase is not a better catchphrase. All right, well, we're gonna say goodbye. Finley, do you wanna say bye to the vlog? Well, that's our vlog and we're sticking to it. <laughs> that's kind of a good catchphrase. That's not It's so kind bad. of a good catchphrase. We're gonna say bye. Do you wanna say goodbye to the vlog, Finley? Bye, Say, you're the best. You're the best. All right, put your hand up. And... Oh.